Alright folks, welcome back to Let's Play Romancy Three Kingdoms 11, or 10, excuse me, on the series JG, and I'm trying to improve the city of Ling Ling. Ling Ling won't do a thing thing until she say eat that ring ring. And, uh, what well, farm is where we're really lagging behind, but my big thing is I want to get advanced enough that we can have a bow garrison going, in the hopes that eventually that means I'll be able to do, um, crossbow troops. But we really need to make sure that trade and farms stay good too, so that our troops don't start starving and we don't start running out of money. So maybe I'll work on farms, since I've got other people working on other stuff. Geodude yeah, troops of Southside's army is defeated, and troop led by a bandit. Well, good for them. I never knew them. Green fields. Four green fields, one to steal and one bird. Patriotic Irish song. Sun Zheng's troops failed because they suck. Well, your failure is my opportunity, buddy. So... If I decided to go attack that city that you just failed to take... Who would my forces be? Summon in, top at ra Raptor, Cronus Darkness, and Jiaochan. Okay. So let's get. Summon in. We'll get everybody except for those four. Working on farm. And we will launch that attack, just for Fonzies. Any frickin' gold. Let's see what happens here. We should be able to do this. If not, I'll lose a lot of troops for no good reason. We should now attack Yong on. <laughs> they softened it up. We finished them off after they'd already done all the work, is what happened there. request to have my uh, government transferred there. I'll let him decide if he wants to put some guys there. We've got plenty of food left. Do we want to uh, sack this place just to piss off Liu Biao? Yeah, see, stipend's down to 2300. So we're doing much better there. They may send somebody to stop us. Otherwise, we're just going to like completely waste all of their time and energy that they put into building this place. Yep. Yay, us. Suck on that, Liu Biao. And our food's gone, because I always manage to do that. But we got some deeds and that's always good. So we'll get back to work on um, domestic type stuff. Selling food, I don't really care about. I don't care about. This is a gamble, but if it pays off, it'll go really well. It did not pay off. I hate this game sometimes. Alright, well our city's almost out of money. But we've got a new prefect in the city that we just took over, so that's good. Chen Ji. The beautiful Lady Chen Ji. Officer Yuan Shu in the campaign against Lu Bu, he led the third army, but met great failure, he put up resistance against Cao Cao. Yeah. His stats almost certainly suck. An officer who is known only for failure usually sucks. I'd try to hire him anyway if I see him again.
That's right, we have new domestic improvement orders. I kind of wasn't paying attention to that when it let us off on a bunch of military campaigns. Okay. So we need to get more tech and more trade. Why is our order drip dropped so low? I built that fort outside of town just so that... I don't really care about this. Probably should have done that. They weren't asking for much money. There it sound in, my favorite super intelligent baby. I'm not talking about his sound in the character. I'm talking about the actual uh, elf hair guy. He is a super intelligent baby. Gong Zan's army is actually on the move. That's cool. They're just going to trade that city back and forth, though. I can now learn the skill trade, which I don't really care about. Hey, we got a couple more sons in the family. And it's assembly time. It's assembly time, dogs. Let's look at how everyone performed last year. Oh, wow, you guys sucked again. It's probably my fault. I'm not using it properly. Not so good to save the land. I didn't take over on Ning before, so things have expanded in a slightly different way. I have no interest in going to war with uh, Liu Yan yet, which is a shame, because he'll be easy to take out, but I don't want to have a border this long to have to defend. It would be foolish to stop here. We have to take over Yeep, and we've got to work on domestic improvement. Yes, excellent. This is like one of my favorite ones to ever see. Yeah, I brought a message from Squared soon. So, well done. You rule. Hey, Top Hat Raptors class went up. That's good. So let's take a look at the city before we continue on. Almost have enough tech to expand to medium, so we probably want to focus on knocking that out. But our farm is lagging, and that makes me nervous, so let's put some guys to work on that. your hat. Okay, stop talking, you guys. <laughs> Suppose that if I bring it up a third of the way on my own, I can count on the others to do the rest. We still can't expand yet, so we're not quite there. Yeah, eight points short. What oh, crap. Alright, well, our order's gone to shit, so let's, uh... Let's get everybody with decent leader, or whatever it is, to work on order. We'll grab a few of these guys off the bottom and put them to work on something else. I trade. Well, you guys won't be that useful there either, but whatever. Oh, okay. Well, here's an order-boosting, uh, thing that we can do. It might be that ignoring um, their petitions is also making the order uh, drop quickly. And if you ha if you play the game and you happen to know that's the case, let me know. Because I would dearly love for the order to not drop quite so rapidly. Now we might not have enough money to expand the city. Because of the rate at which I'm running through it. But we've got enough tech, so we should be able to expand. Should be good. And I can give that that always boosts your, your deeds quite a bit. I do not have enough gold. Crap. Alright. Everybody. 
Let's get stone. Everybody work on increasing our gold. In the long run, it's obviously not going to be a short-term thing. And I will deliberate. Let's see how we're doing for food. Can I sell some food? Strength is not that high. We really need to... Yeah, we can, we can afford to sell some food, so I'll do that. I'll talk to Draconis Darkness, too. Hi, Master Draconis Darkness. I was unable to ignore injustice. I'm fighting for gay rights, as you can tell by my face. Officer Drink Late Han is a valued officer of Sun Tzu. Yeah, for some reason I actually got stupid and expected her to have Diao Chan's actual biography, and I forgot that, oh, wait, this is a creative character. Super intelligent baby, who was the son of Cao Cao, but for some reason <laughs> worked for Sun Tzu. Count you've won countless battles despite being a small baby who has never been in battle. I guess she was in a battle. He fought with us, uh, taking over one of those cities that, uh, just kind of didn't have anybody in it, and we just attacked it anyway. Welcome to the Satellite of Love. Wow, that's not really a lot of gold. I'm selling a lot of food. That might have been a really bad move. Let's see. Whoa, yeah, that was a bad move. Shit. Okay, that was that was very poorly played on my part. Oh, we're still in trouble. Shit. Okay, I just really screwed everything up here. A lot. Okay, I just broke the city here, and that sucks. I got a lot more gold than I had, though. Yeah, that was really bad, JG. Why did you do that? Why did you do that? What I don't quite understand is why... I sold some of the food, but it was coming in faster than we were using it, so why suddenly I don't have enough? I should have been able to sell almost all the food without having a big problem there. Panjun wants to do it. I do want to do it, but I didn't want him to do it, so he will be unhappy with that, and rightly so. But I want to give the deeds to somebody who needs a promotion in class. Top Hat Raptor would be a good choice. Yao Chan, I was going to give it to her just because I favor the characters from Dynasty Warriors, but she's already class 5. So it would be an easy way to get Draconis Darkness up by another class, or um, sound in. And Town in hired Draconis Darkness, didn't he? I'll give him the nod. You'll get it next time, Draconis. Master Town in, I can order you to expand Ling Ling. Understood. Like I said, they're trading back and forth, that city. Damn. Alright, we'll talk to all these officers. 
But I really should not have sold that food. Apparently I picked the worst possible time to do that. One food is 70 gold. Okay. Well, I got rid of all of our city's gold, but at least I can, um... At least I can just kind of chill out for a while and not spend a lot of money, and we should be able to... to get some gold back. Here, now I can learn the skill farm. That's my lifelong dream. He was skilled in domestic affairs and criticized for seeking his own profit and for being untrustworthy. And, uh, he tried to get me to... He tried to tell me to expand the city walls, but I wanted to give that assignment to somebody else. And I resented the idea that he thought it was his idea. Okay, he'll be at that for a while. So there's, like, no domestic commands we can do now. Yeah, we don't have enough money to do this. Oh, it only costs 100 gold to pop. We actually can do this. No, we can't. Okay, I'll send you guys out on searches because sometimes they find gold that way. This is kind of a silly use of your officers, but... Worst that can happen is they don't find anything, so. The rest of you can improve order. And I'm going to deliberate. I will improve order too, it looks like. And I want to look at the cities here. I need to get a spy in Jiang Yang, because I think the next order of business is to take out Liu Biao. I'm not... <laughs> Pardon me. I'm not giving away food, not after the way that went last time. And not that this guy's uh, advocating just throwing it away like an idiot on a handful of gold, but... I will personally do some spying now. It also means that we'll get a chance to see a duel or debate for the first time in a long time. Those are always fun. Uh, let's try a debate this time. I'll do a duel next time. Because I think I'll go spy in one of uh, his other cities while I'm up here. I'll show you how foolish you are to challenge me. Um, I didn't challenge you, buddy, but okay. No, I mean you challenged my right to enter the city. Uh -huh. You should obey the rules of proper manners and speak to others. Ha! You're a douchebag. What? Governance is advanced through desire. What do you desire? Oh, man. He's got a... Focus and stuff. I gotta get rid of that. Loyal words are music to the ears. Loyal acts are music to the heart. Uh, okay. Both had the same idea there. True adult is one who never loses the innocence of a baby's heart. Oh, you mean like Nin, Nin Sao Nin? I mean, ah! Sometimes my brilliance scares even me. I'm terrifyingly badass. Hey, I got one fame. That's nice. What a foolish guy. That's uh, Wan Fu's quote when he's getting ready to face um, the final boss in Samurai Shodan 2. There's no particular reason you would have known that. 
Hey, here's a bunch of guys I can chat with. You're the show you I've heard them talk so much about lately. It's how now he's kind of a jerk. Try to kill Liu Bei. Then in this novel, who didn't? Hey, Ling Ling is now expanded. Good job. Uh, crossbow upgrades are available. Excellent. Jiao Chan found gold. Just been whoring herself out. I, I Zhou Yu, and I am spying on your city. Draconis Dark has found some gold, but not as much as Jiao Chan. You'll get there eventually, buddy. Top Hat Raptor found even more gold. Zhao Kang found an officer, but couldn't hire them. Let's. Yeah, I better view this tool, otherwise, it's a real good chance I'll lose. Yeah, I've got a small advantage here, but he's got Crush, so this might have been a bad idea. But it's too late for regrets. You darn Jackanape! Blast. I always like to evade in the middle in case he's going for this. Exactly. Uh, not a chance, not a chance. Now you can't always tell what which of the three top, middle, or bottom positions the special attack command will be in, but the generic ones that even guards can do are pretty much always in the middle. So I'm actually... There's been some luck involved, but I'm actually doing this pretty well. Now I'm out of evade commands, though, so... Nice. I think it's probably for the best that I'm not really trying to get those attack commands. If they happen on their own, I'll let it happen. Although, having said that, I'm now going to try and get one, because I've got two of the red ones going. Ooh, excellent. It's always nice when you manage to hit them even though they evaded. And now, forget it. Let's go for a bunch of strikes. So I pretty much won anyway, there's no point in dragging this thing out. First know yourself, fool. Two wins, zero losses, and an increase of fame of one. Zhou Yu, sworn brother of Sun Tzu, prefect of Ling Ling, master strategist, once beat up a guy. Hey, we've been ordered to increase domestic crap. The few search didn't do anything because he sucks. And uh, I think that's, yeah, thanks to Cao Cao attacking him even more aggressively than we have. That's pretty much it for Liu Biao's empire. Minister Xu served various posts, including Prefect. Cried when he learned of the death of Zhigeli. Pussy. Oh, you don't want to join me? Oh, you're gonna cry now? Cry, baby? One, two, three, cry. Why am I just talking to this guy instead of giving my guys new orders? order. Alright, well you guys are gonna suck at this, but whatever. Oh! I'm sorry, my uh, screen went to sleep on me. I don't know if you guys will see that or not. Hey, where the heck
heck is my uh, sound recorder thing? Okay, I had a little scare there for a minute. I thought I wasn't getting this commentary track. Alright. Which would suck, because it's been kind of a long uh, session. Shut up. Okay, now I can go find anybody who's hanging around in some place other than those two places. And try to hire them. And I'm talking, of course, about the owlie. You know, it's sort of a shame that I'm not closer friends with some of these officers, but once you start giving them orders all the time, instead of chatting with them like this, you sort of interact with them a lot without realizing that you're not interacting with them in a way that's going to make them actually increase their, you know, like for you. That guy's just starting to piss me off now. This got done giving away a bunch of officers because they were taking up too much money, but now I'm right back to my old Pokemon approach. So I can always send him to some other city. Yay! So I'll work on trade while I wait for everyone else to finish up their orders. So that I can assign them to do more stuff. Who's at the gate? Ah, Chenji. Okay, where are we at now? We still need a lot of farming to be done. Now our order's gone down, so you guys can work on that. Just... How, how hungry are you, buddy? You need 5,000 food? And I'm just going to keep chatting with him because all officers must work for me, I've decided. I'd be very interested in your opinion in current affairs. Sure, now where shall we begin? Show you and Chenji managed to keep a strange conversation going. Let's talk again. Please excuse me. And we're friends. Let's be friends. We'll do days together. I'll talk to Zhao Kang by mistake. Hey, buddy, would you like to come work for me for the rest of your life? No. And they're continuing to trade that city back and forth. That's great. I'd rather not waste my time talking to you. Now we're trusted friends, which means you better start freaking working for me. You're gonna be a real bitch about this, aren't you? Why do I even want him in my force? He's got an okay pole. But he's not really great at anything in particular. But I need people to run Ling Ling when I'm ready to transfer out of here. Once we become really close friends. This is where you're supposed to spend gold to buy gifts and bribe people, but I just prefer to slam away on the chat button until we become super best friends. He is still undecided. Attempt further persuasion. Perversion, I lost that. I'm not sure where that was coming from. I ought to be able to just defeat him without even getting to talk. I'll take your challenge. Now it's going to make me go through with it. You should obey the rules of etiquette. Shut the fuck up. No. Look, I can't explain it, but I know I'm right. I must admit the truth of some of your words. 
You don't have to admit the truth of that, you. you? Shut up. <gasps> you spew. I just told him he was too dumb to understand, and he's like, oh, okay. Can't argue with that logic. Also need to think about whether we want to keep hanging out here. They've got 60,000. How many could I send after them? 35,000. That's not really enough. I'd have to get reinforcements. What if I went over here instead? No, I can't. I, have to take, I can't even take this city until I take this one. Alright, I'll tell you what we're going to do, folks. We're going to call it a video. When we come back, I'll probably need to start, you know, building up my military again. Uh, so that we can take out Liu Biao. And then we really will have no choice but to start fighting Cao Cao. Uh, so, that'll be exciting. Things are business about to pick up, as they say. And uh, it'll happen in the next video. Thanks for watching, folks. I'll see you then.